Welcome to Lent, Day 17, Restoring Relationships. As we continue our Lenten journey, we find ourselves at the 17th day, a pivotal moment for reflection and renewal, centered around the theme of restoring relationships. Within the intricate fabric of human existence, relationships serve as the delicate threads connecting us to one another and to the divine. Today, let us pause and delve into the profound call for reconciliation and restoration that lies at the very heart of our faith, relationships, whether with fellow humans or with God, constitute a fundamental aspect of our shared human experience. Yet, in the brokenness of our world, these relationships often bear the weight of fractures, strained by misunderstandings. Conflicts and wounds inflicted by our own hands. Amidst this brokenness, Lent beckons us to confront the barriers that divide us, to seek healing for the wounds that separate us, and to embark on a transformative journey of reconciliation and restoration. At the core of the Lenten message lies the profound truth of God's reconciling love, a love that bridges the chasm between humanity and divinity. It extends forgiveness and restoration to all who seek it. Through the sacrificial love of Jesus Christ, we are invited into this transformative journey, a journey that commences with the restoration of our relationship with God and extends to the healing of our relationships with one another. Today, as we reflect on the theme of restoring relationships, let us heed the words of the Apostle Paul. He reminds us that we are called to be ambassadors of reconciliation, agents of God's healing grace in a broken world. May this day be a sacred opportunity, an invitation to extend forgiveness, seek reconciliation, and rebuild what has been broken. In doing so, we actively participate in the redemptive work that God has initiated through Christ. Verse of the Day Today's verse of the day is taken from Matthew chapter 5 verses 23 to 24. Therefore, if you are offering your gift at the altar and there remember that your brother or sister has something against you, leave your gift there in front of the altar. First, go and be reconciled to them, then come and offer your gift. Reflection Reconciliation is at the heart of the Gospel. As we journey through Lent, let us seek to reconcile broken relationships, extend forgiveness to those who have wronged us, and pursue peace with all people. Let us pray. Prince of Peace, help us to be peacemakers in a world filled with conflict and division. Give us the humility to seek reconciliation and the grace to forgive as you have forgiven us. Amen.